And everything has an, a beginning and unfortunately an end. We've had three full days. We've had lots of different demonstrations, presentations, everything taking place in spaces of huge natural value and unique spots that are offered by this island. So Benjamin, please, a uh, representative from the Lanzarote Island Council, please take your uh, seat on the stage and the executive director of Vosendo, who will be taking us through the last, let's uh, stand a little bit apart so that we can take our masks off now. Honestly, throughout these three days, I've learnt a great deal. I've witnessed the art of cooking from all of these chefs, and I wanted to share with you some of my reflections. First of all, obviously, we must have another event like this in, again in the future. We've just seen all of these different ways of putting a spring onion and an onion to use, and I would love to be able to have more opportunities to discover other uh, uh, things like this in a future edition. I think we need to involve actually much more people in this event. This is the very first edition of the conference, but we must continue to grow inviting more people from Lanzarote because it's a, 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 a way there are all different layers of, of the his, his hospitality sector in Lanzarote, and I think we need to bring all of these different actors in to raise our game. This is really something very distinctive, very unique. Lanzarote has always been a reference point for this volcanic cooking, this unique style. and. As we said in the Jameos del Agua, this is the perfect occasion to showcase all of these unique techniques. Congratulations to all of the companies that have taken part, the different participants from all different backgrounds. We've very much enjoyed it. I would like to give my sincere thanks for the organization. It's been a huge success. I think. I think it's going to uh, lead us on to greater things and it's uh, been a real kick up the bum in a way. We must continue. So please let's give a big round of applause for this great success. Bueno. Sí. Okay. Okay. Well, what's left to say? <laughs> I'm standing next to another Benjamin. Usually when we see each other in a meeting, we always turn around. We're usually actually the only Benjamin in the room, so it's very strange to be standing next to another Benjamin, and he's a, a nice guy as well. Well, I have very little to add, really, until not long ago. As I, I think I said, that this came up with a, this, this started as a very strange idea, then it became a project, and now it's become a challenge for the future. We haven't even finished Volcanic, and we're already thinking about the next edition, and when that happens, it means it's been a success. We're very open to new ways to grow and new things to include. And we're very happy with how everything's uh, panned out. We've very much enjoyed this symbiosis of uh, participants from all different backgrounds. We've very much enjoyed the, the landscape that we've been surrounded by, which has been our common point of reference as well. I think we can all agree that we have a clear path ahead of us to continue working on this volcanic cuisine and volcanic culture. On behalf of everybody, not only the organization, but the participants, I would like to thank all of our host uh, uh, 
locations, all of the population, actually, the restaurant workers, the places that we visited, we've been welcomed very warmly everywhere we've been. I've very much enjoyed the way we've moved around the island and haven't just been sat in one uh, conference center. So let's see what other places we can include for next year. I think that there is actually room for other sectors to be involved within this world of volcanic uh, things to do with volca volcanoes. I think that, of course, the cooking element of this is what brings everyone together, but we can also bring in eno tourism, agro industry, etc. So the last thing I to say is, I suppose, thank you to the Lanzarote Island Council, to everyone on the island of Lanzarote. Thank you also, of course, to Bocento and the, the team at the center who've been working very hard to turn this idea into a reality for the past year and a half. Thank you to everyone, but in particular Juan, who has been the, the driver of this uh, event, always uh, in the background, pushing us forward. Of course, this was a team effort. I think I've mentioned other team members uh, but perhaps not Jordi Bada, who is the head uh, chef. He's the, in charge of the kitchen. We haven't seen him on stage, but he's always been in the background managing all the different teams. And all of the meals that we've enjoyed have worked like clockwork, thanks to this man. Thanks to Irene and your team. I can see back here Dani as well and more people. I can see Felix over there. Rossi is uh, injured right now, uh, but he's not here, but thank you as well. So we're going to uh, move on now to the very last part. Uh, we're going to enjoy some uh, traditional cooking. This includes the most creative cooking, visions for the future, and traditional cooking. We have a more relaxed uh, format now. It's going to be a buffet. I would like to uh, call to the stage before they start working a, a few people. Tonio Morales, of course, who is hosting us very kindly today. You all met him this morning where he showed you around his uh, eco estate. So Tonio, Luis, Leone, Ernesto Palomar from Trattoria Il Nono in Arrecife, Juan Colos Monzón from the Santiago Bodega in Yaisa, Juan El Majorero de Brisa from Brisa Maria Restaurant in Playa Blanca, Cristóbal Santana from Casa Brígida Restaurant in Playa Blanca, Tonio Marales from the Vecina Club La Santa Restaurant in La Santa, Maria Díaz de Cascada from the restaurant in Puerto del Carmen, La Cascada, Jonay Perdomo from the Risco restaurant in Fumara in Teguise, and Fefo Nives from uh, Mermelada, the restaurant. I've seen you back there somewhere as well. So to all of you, thank you. We are very much looking forward to enjoying this last event. I've heard some people back there who are very much looking forward to drinking quite a lot of wine this afternoon now that we've finished working. I would love to give you all the chance to say a few words, but I think uh, it will take a bit too much time. So uh, if anyone would like to say a few words, then please step forward, uh, feel free. Those uh, cooks that have been involved. Well, thank you. Just one thing, the photos that are hanging on the walls are part of a project from the Dinaje municipality in collaboration with the university. And they attempt to 
highlight this transformation of the territory that we've been referring to so much throughout the conference. So as you leave, please have a look on the left. There is an exhibition. These photos are linked to it. Uh, the goal is to give you uh, an idea about the different foods that are grown here in the estate. And there is also uh, there are some samples of our main supplier of fish. And my friend Frances is there. So on your way out, please take a moment to just have a look around. Just a minute and a half is enough. So please enjoy it. Thank you. Gracias, Tonio. Thank you, Tonio. Pues, Maria. Maria, it's your turn. Good afternoon, everyone. Nice to meet you. As you can see, I think we represent the island very well. And today we're going to offer you a series of traditional dishes, things that we've always eaten since a young age and still eating as adults and have continued developing over time. And I think everyone here today has something individual to offer for you. I hope you enjoy it. Anyone else? Come on. I always have to speak and I'm the worst at doing it. But anyway, thank you so much. Thank you to the organizers. Thank you for the huge effort that's, you know, uh, been taken to make sure that Lanzarote is represented in its entirety here. We're going to, of course, continue working on this project. Let's hope that next year is bigger and better. Thank you. Pues nos comprometemos a, para el año que viene. Yes, we are committed to celebrating the second edition of Volcanic next year.